Los Angeles, Southern California is starting to dry out Thursday from a cold, slow-moving storm that rolled through the region bringing much-needed rain and creating slick and dangerous driving conditions on freeways and streets. Rain soaked many parts of Southern California Wednesday, even flooding streets and isolated areas with brief downpours, while also driving down temperatures that could bring snow to mountain areas before the storm system moves out of the area. Lingering showers with lowering snow levels are expected. A cold air mass will remain in place across the region for the next several days, then gusty north to northeast winds are expected to bring a slight warming trend for the end of the week, according to the National Weather Service. The colder temperatures and possibility of snow prompted the new to issue a winter weather advisory for the Los Angeles County Mountains that will be in effect through 10 a.m. Thursday. Forecasters said mountain areas could get up to 2 inches of snow, accompanied by winds of 20 to 30 miles per hour, gusting up to 45 miles per hour. Up to an inch of snow could potentially accumulate on the 5 freeway in the Grapevine area. In the Antelope Valley, a freeze watch will be in effect Thursday night into Friday morning, with temperatures potentially dipping to 25 degrees, according to the new. The Santa Clarita Valley will also be under a freeze watch Thursday night and Friday morning, with the mercury possibly falling to 28 degrees. The Wednesday morning rain created headaches for commuters, with isolated downpours flooding some streets and limiting visibility on some freeways. Three lanes of the westbound Santa Monica Freeway and South Hoover Street in South Los Angeles were closed for about two hours early Wednesday morning due to a crash likely prompted by the rain. Three southbound lanes and one northbound lane of the 5 Freeway near San Fernando Mission Road in Somar were closed around 1.30 a. Because a big rig hydroplaned and crashed into the center divider, 